Today we're going to talk about cold weather and freezing for your water softener. It's rare that it happens, but it can happen. When water is not moving at all through the pipes, it can set up and then expand the pipe and crack it. We recommend, when it's going to get really cold, or even throughout the year, that you use some kind of insulation on the piping coming up through the back. The other thing you can do also is get a heat lamp and you can get uh, an adapter that plugs into the 110 outlet and then will turn on at 34 degrees and just either heat, heat the well house or heat the plumbing behind the water softener. Tanks can crack uh, and develop a hairline crack down the side if it completely freezes. Uh, the way to alleviate that is also too, to run some water inside the house. Uh, just a little trickle at the sinks will keep the water moving throughout everything. Again, this is rare, but if it gets really cold for an extended period of time, these things can happen. So, drip some water, heat lamp or milk house, milk box heater, and insulation, and you should be good to go. If there's any problems, you can always reach out and give us a call. Or if you have more questions, just give us a shout. Thank you.